walking trophy. You a walking trophy. My girl, you a walking trophy. Yeah, your friends, them a walking trophy. Tell a girl, say, girl, you know, say you're pretty from your band. Walk out, tell you not try on. Shamika, welcome back to my channel. Um, today I'm coming at y'all with a hairstyling video. I'm going to show you how I got this hairstyle and how I just styled my, uh, what you want to call it? My TWA. And I just wanted to show you how I style. My hair is a 3C, 4A. So if you want to see how I got this look, just keep watching. So I just wanted to show y'all um, how I style my hair. Um, everything you need to know about my hair, how I dab it, all that good stuff is going to be in, um, my previous video, which is going to go up before this one, and it's going to be my update on my hair journey, so check in the description box, I might have it up in the cards right here, and check that video out, and you'll learn everything about my hair and what's going on and all that, but in this video, I just wanted to show y'all how I style my hair, so let's get to it. First, I'm going to take this do-rag off. And voila. I don't do anything to my hair at night before I go to sleep. I just put my do-rag on. So this is what it looks like from me styling it yesterday. Just smashed down under the do-rag. So I'm going to just hit it, with a, hit it with one of these. Okay. Lift some of that hair up. <clears throat> yeah. And I don't know how bright this is showing up on camera, but my hair is very bright and I'm loving this color. I do need to put some water on this. So hold, hold that. Okay. So I just wet my hair. I pretty much just dampened it up. And I'm going to take this comb. And I'm just going to do a little comb out. Now, I don't know if you guys watched my previous hair video when I did, was doing my hair color, I believe. And I had said in my hair color video, this part of my hair is just, it does, it's very thin. And it kind of go back to like right here-ish. And it's, on, it's the same way on this side. It's just very thin. My hair doesn't grow there. It's just, there's no hair coming through what the hair follicles or whatever. And my mom's hair is the same way. And I hate to keep addressing it. So, yeah, but I just wanted to let you know because I know some of y'all might be looking like what the hell's going on with her hair but it's it's a genetic thing it's nothing i could do about it i've learned to embrace it and it is what it is now i did a little comb out so now i got a little fro now um yeah this is just what my hair looks like after i comb it uh this part of my hair like the front half of my hair is like 3c and then no not 3c it's like um yeah 3c right here and then it's uh 4a in the back my hair is real tight in the back and real loose in the front um then i'm gonna go in with auntie jackie's um, moisturizer is moisturizer intense leave-in conditioner i love this stuff if you have really fine hair i have really fine hair um, and out of my, uh, what you call it? My hair density isn't, it's really low. Like, it's not high. So, I, I don't have a lot of hair on my head, if that makes sense. But I just work with what I got. And I think for very fine hair and stuff, this, this work really good. Because it moisturizes it. It, it moisturizes it really good without weighing it down. So, I just put this in on top. I haven't started using oil on my hair yet. Normally, I use my grapeseed oil, but my hair is so thin. Right, well, not thin, but it's so short right now that using that, it'll make my hair look wet looking. And I like my hair to look more fluffy because when it looks wet, it looks even thinner. 
so but I just worked that all in there and then I'm going to go in with the James Carter solution it's the cocktail the curl cocktail this is really 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 good um and then I'm just going to I kind of like put it in my hair like this And just work it in there and then I'll just put it in them sacks my hands are turn red I'll just work it in and bending my hair is growing it has a little I don't know if you guys can see that but it has a little curl to it so I kind of like grab it and pull at it just to get that curl to form and I'll put a little product on my hand and just go in and pull at it cuz and I just like pull and kind of like turn or I might just finger it like that cuz it's like I gotta help it I gotta help the curl kind of form because it's there it's forming I don't know if you guys can see that but like I have little curls but it ain't enough hair to give me like a spiral type curl the way my hair normally curls so it's kind of giving me like a little flip type thing and I gotta help I gotta help it get that curl and this is how I be styling my hair every day I really have to go in with the the cream for my edges. Like I gotta make sure I dip my finger in there to get it to work. Cause like I said, my hair is really loose in the front. So it's like a 3C and it's like a bigger curl. So it takes my hair a little longer in the front to form a curl since the curl is so big versus the back. And this is pretty much what I do. And this is how I style my hair every day. And that's how I style my hair. Now, I'm going to come back and let y'all see once it's dry. And I'm All right, y'all. I'm back. As you can see, I got makeup and stuff on. And this is what my hair is looking like. And it's all dry. Let me do a little spin. You can see what my hair is looking like. Okay, so I be looking a little sketchy on the sides and stuff. So sometimes just to fluff it out, make it a little thicker, I go on my brush. And I'm just fluffy. And you, as you... You can tell from this side, it's kind of a little flutter, but look a little, a little thicker and then fluffed up a little bit. So I don't want to really brush the curls out, but just, you know, brush it out just a little bit to give me a little extra on that side. Because even though it's thin right there, I still want it to look as full as possible. So, Whoop. okay, then on this side, just go and brush it a little bit. And I pull at it too. But as far as that, that's all I do to my hair for real. That's how I style it. I was thinking about doing me a um 
I was thinking about doing a um, slick down. So y'all let me know in the comments if I should do a slick down. Because I believe my hair is long enough now for me to do a slick down. But that's it for how I style my hair. I thank y'all for watching. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe down below. And tell all of your little friends and family members to subscribe to my channel and also watch. Help support your girl. Trying to grow my channel. Thanks. Bye.